In the spring of 1944, Edith Piaf performed at the Moulin Rouge, one of the top nightclubs in Paris. Her warm-up act was a handsome 22-year-old singer named Yves Montand. She had heard him on other occasions, but she didn't think she liked his singing very much. He would sing sort of pseudo-cowboy songs and things of that sort. Piaf was in the middle of an affair with her latest composer, but dropped him for the up-and-coming crooner. And she decided to make him a star. She made him. She told him what color to wear, how to move. The first time she saw him, he had a big cowboy hat. Anything from the States was considered very fashionable, and a checkered jacket, which was his idea of being American. She told him, that doesn't work. You have to wear dark colors. We have to be able to see all your gestures. And she started to loosen him up like a dancer. She made Montan into a great star, really did. Piaf appeared with Montan in a film. He was later to become one of France's top stars. But as the filming ended, so did the relationship. <laughs> 